Alright, uh, welcome back guys to another brand new video. This is a double upload time. Why? Because, um, I just read a comment on my second channel. In, uh, in here. Let's pause that. Uh, how you make high quality shadow. Now, um, that is, uh, basically, I don't know what he means, but I assume he means, like, uh, high quality, uh, like, you know, as you see here, like, realistic shadows and and stuff. Um, so, uh, today I will be showing you how to do that. First of all, you don't necessarily need baked lighting for this. Well, it, you can. It'll make it look very good. But, um, uh, you could just use, um, in your Unity registry, just click this and click Unity registry. In here, you're going to search up post. And something called post processing should show up. Just click install. Now, once that installed, um, you want to go to your main comma, and you want to add a post process layer. And uh, after you've done that, you want to make the layer to everything, and you you want to make a new layer called post processing, and you want to make it your comma. And um, after you've done that, you want to. Turn this on. This basically just makes the uh, effect smoother. Turn on fast mode, and that should be it for the main camera. Now go to your directional light. This is where it gets cool. So uh, in here, you're going to add a post-process volume. And and uh, you're going to go into here. You're going to click create. And something like this should pop up. You want to create a post-processing volume. Now you want to take that post processing volume that you made, sorry, post processing, and you want to drag it into your where it says profile. S sorry, not post processing volume, post processing profile. Damn, I'm blind. Um, but uh, yeah, and then uh, that should be it. Turn is global on, and yeah, uh, if you're making bait lighting, make sure to put every single object apart from your gorilla rig. Everything inside of your gorilla rig and your photon of your things static. So um basically you can add some bloom, which is what you're seeing in your lights right now. My lights right now, sorry. Intensity I recommend a threshold uh zero point nine and wherever you see fast mode on any effect, I recommend you turn it on. Just just turn it on, on any effect that it says fast mode, just turn it on instantly. So, um, in mode, you can just choose whatever mode you want. I choose classic. It's basically this little effect, like this. I want to keep it on 0 0.4. It's probably the best, 0 0.4. There you go. And, uh, yeah, that is how you add good shadows and, uh, realistic lighting. So, uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Bye.